Hi all of you. Today our new topic is coordinate systems. In AutoCAD, we have to use the coordinate systems for basic designs. In coordinate systems, we have three types of coordinate systems. They are absolute coordinate system, related coordinate system, and polar coordinate system. These all are used by used with the base of coordinates, but there are slight difference in this. That is, here we have in absolute coordinate system we have mentioned only x and y. X comma y. This is a, as usually common in every place. But in relative coordinate system, we have to fix the values or points related to the previous one. That means at the rate comma x comma y. I will be explaining explain this previous before. After that, polar coordinate system. In polar coordinate system also, slight variation. I have to explain this. Before that, we are going to absolute coordinate system. In absolute coordinate system, we have to observe here. From horizon, there is a one rectangle here. At the origin, we have the point given like x comma y as zero comma zero. At a length of four, it will be four comma zero. After that, it will be four comma two. Why? Because of x is four, y is two. Here, y is two, x is zero at this point. This is common absolute coordinate system. It represents as x comma y at a points on graph. This is zero, one, two, three, four. So this is four in x-axis. Y is one, two. So x is four, y is two here. Here the four is here x-axis is zero. This point has x is zero. Then y is two. Okay, again it will be comes to the origin O. After that, relative coordinate system. In relative coordinate system, we have to observe the points like previous points. So that means base the point at the rate of previous. Here, origin is casually zero point zero comma zero. After that, it will be exceed to four. In x-axis, extend it to four meter four points one two three four. Here four comma zero. Why? Because here y is zero. In x-axis, y is zero. After that, here you have to increase the y-axis as two meters. That means two points. That's why here x is zero. We have taken and y is two. Why? Because in relative coordinate system, we have to give like this. Here, you don't change the x-axis. I mean, x value here. Here, x is four. So, the, after that, here also four. We have to change only y-axis. That's why we have to change the only y coordinate. If you change x, like uh, here is four. Here, you have to give the five. Here is four. If you view the change, if you change this like a one point extra, that is five. Here you have to mention the five comma two. Otherwise, you don't mention here x-axis. Why? Because it will be based upon our previous points at the right. That's why here x is not changed. It will be zero. Here y will be changed. Here y will be two. After that. Here y will be not changed. Only x will be changed. That is in opposite direction. That means in negative direction. Here x is four. Here also x is four. But we can't mention why because based upon our previous point. Here y is two. Here also y is two. But we can't mention. Here we have to mention only x value. That means x is in negative direction from here to here. It comes opposite direction. That's why it is in minus. From here also, we have to mention x is zero. 
that means y is minus 2 why because from here to here the point will be in opposite direction from here to here it will be comes in opposite direction that's why it will be minus 2 okay here x is 0 here also 0 but we can't mention here x as 0 why because in x it is in moving direction relative means it will be related to the previous point as it will be movable condition next go to polar next go to polar coordinate system here polar means angle at the rate of value and angle here polar horizon as 0 comma 0 it is in 0 degrees after that we have to move for we have to move 4 units in x axis with 0 degrees here angle is less than or equal to 0 degrees I can't mention here here we have to mention the angle as less than 0 degrees it is in x axis after that we have to move 2 units above the y axis so here you have to mention like 2 comma less than 90 degrees why because it is in vertical so here we have to mention 90 degrees from 0 degrees y axis is 0 sorry if x axis is 0 y axis is 90 degrees that means perpendicular to the x axis after that we have to move from this point to here with in x axis 4 here also we have to move 4 units that's why we have to mention 4 length here L means length less than angle we have to mention here we have to move 4 units and here also we have to move 4 units this is in positive direction this is in negative direction that's why we have to mention here as 0 degrees here as 180 degrees so here we have to mention as angles in polar in coordinate system we have three coordinate systems absolute coordinate system relative coordinate system and polar coordinate system all are based upon this horizon but the mention the values are different considering points are different here in absolute coordinate system all are taken in actual coordinate systems but in relative and polar coordinate system we have to mention the length uh, sorry in polar we have to mention the length in relative coordinate system we have to relate it to the previous points after that the considering points are different here absolute coordinate system only x comma y we have to consider like x comma y after that uh, relative coordinate system we have to consider the values like at the right comma x comma y and in polar coordinate system we have to mention the points like at the rate length comma angle okay here you have to view a rectangle for us just select a rectangle first corner point i have to view the horizon as 0 comma 0 enter you have to observe here it will be selected the horizon option then i want to view Okay, uh, 5 comma 5 in x axis and uh, 10 in y axis and then this is our rectangle according to our coordinate system okay next next I want to give one letter like E so I want to select 0 comma 0 enter from here onwards I have to move my line in x axis 4 comma 0 and then from here I want to view 90 degrees put ortho f8 here I want to move 2 meters above that's why x is 4 comma y is 2 and then. Here this is uh, 
I want to give two. Okay, we have to move in x direction. It will be 2 and y will be 2. Next, it will be 2. I want to increase from here. This is uh, 2 meters. From here to here, 2 meters. So, y is what? X is 2. 2 comma 4 enter here this is uh, x is 2 y is 4 then here to change the x axis as the extra 2 so 4 comma this will be here to here to 4 and extra to 4 6 and um, escape Control J. Oh, I'm sorry. It will be gone. So again, Control Y. Okay, and will be deleted this. So like this, I have to change the value. So from here, X is uh, to right. X is to here. So I have to change extra to four comma Y is six. And then here our next point four comma eight will be given next. After that, you have to increase and decrease the x values to and y, 2 in x axis and 2 in y axis. Then I have to give the values. After that, it is again 2. This is 4. Uh, 1 minute. From coordinate systems, by using coordinate systems, we have to draw like this. E. Again, it will be 0, comma, comma, 0. So, our E will be completed. If you take perfect dimensions, we have to come, we have to draw E in perfect, but uh, I lose some dimension here i think it is will really be perfect okay i think it will be perfect same same like this we have to use the coordinate systems for different types of letters in english or uh, different types of structures by using coordinate system from different types of coordinate systems also we have to use like uh, this is a uh, this is from absolute coordinate system Along with the absolute coordinate system, we have to draw any type of letter by using the related coordinate system and polar coordinate system. Maximum we have to draw in only absolute coordinate system. No horizon only. Here I have to change my horizon like this. Again, I have to draw one rectangle from horizon to now uh, it is 10 comma 10 and this is my square okay again i have to take a rectangle then i don't know i don't want horizon so from this point i have to give again here 10 comma 10 so our ending point will be same but the starting point horizon not be same. That's why the length and the two sides are different. But opposite corner point will be same. That's why 
um, for this purpose we have to use the coordinate systems because of perfect point inside thank you